Hey guys, it's Adam for RealHomeRecording.com. If you're recording electric guitar, here's a tip that a lot of the major studios use that really helps in just getting things done. Now you gotta have separate rooms, that's kind of the key. So if, you're, if you have a control room that's separate from your live room like we have, you gotta have that. Otherwise, this is kind of a waste. But number one, you gotta have about a 30 to 40 foot long speaker cable. Make sure it's a speaker cable. You cannot use guitar cable for amps. You can, it, it can really start a fire, to be honest with you, if it's powerful enough. But um, the idea is that you run a speaker cable from your amp, and um, I'll show you the back here. So that's all we got. We got the power cable in, speaker cable running out. And, that, and that's gonna run all the way to the cabinet out in the live room. And what that enables us to do is in here we'll, um, we'll listen to how the guitar tone sounds and we're able to mess around with the different knobs in the room while we're, uh, while we're getting our signal. And that saves time running back and forth between here and there. It also lets you use a shorter guitar cable, um, which helps a little bit in the tone as well. Um, the other suggestion that I have is to have your guitar player playing in another room so you know have, have the guitar cable running um, here we have an isolation booth or a vocal booth but have them in the other room or in the live room if your cable's long enough so that you're not hearing the actual strings being plucked while you're listening to guitar tone and uh, that's my tips for now for electric guitar recording again this is adam for realhomerecording.com one more thing I forgot to mention. Do not, under any circumstances, turn an amp on without a cable being plugged into it. It actually warns you on the back, it warns you in the manual, but if you're not somebody who likes to look at that stuff, don't do it. You always gotta have a cable plugged in to the speakers or to the guitar cabinet, whatever you wanna call it. Amp, cable, cabinet. You take one elf, you turn that on, that can be a problem. Um, they warn you for a reason, and I'm warning you, because it's legit.